Michael. It's where it all begins again. The lifting of the trophy, the winners' medals. That was all back in May. A mere reminder, a wreck of the glory that was and what may be to come, perhaps for one of these. This place is living up to its reputation as one of the noisiest corners of the footballing world. No decibel spared in this collective chorus. So it's back, bigger and better than ever before. I do hope everybody is ready for another ride on the emotional roller coaster. Bring it on, Peter. I'm looking forward to a competition that always delivers entertainment, whether through its football or indeed its supporting cast of, of emotions. Neither of these teams will want a, a trip back to the drawing board after this, so I think we can expect something quite lively. Gets things running. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Well, Peter, Erling Haaland is developing a massive reputation. The raw power, the speed, the ability to find the net in all sorts of ways. Sometimes you just wonder how you're going to stop him. And I think, as a defender, you'd be hard-pressed for answers. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. He steps in, and that's the end of that. Now then, the ball's come loose. Massive leap! Good delivery, but no joy. You really could have done with engaging those crosses much higher up the pitch there. This isn't good defending. Now it's Haaland. Now it's De Bruyne. Arch been into shapes to shoot! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. They're full of belief that it'll pay off. Real Madrid. Well, Peter, look how far up the fullbacks are getting now. This is really high. And constantly after the ball, aren't they? Yeah, I think they're they're weighing up their options to see how long they can sustain this and, and suppress those wide opposition players. He's shifting through the gears here. Made out to the left flank. While the crowd clearly liked what they just saw, some real no-nonsense defending. It's De Bruyne. 
Now it's Doku. And he's on his way! Room for a shot. Now it's Foden. Foden! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Their second corner now. And now a sudden chance to counter. Come backwards here. Doku. Fadio. Now Foden. Nacho hit the slide tackle there. If you have just joined us, well, you've missed no goals. Nicely intercepted. Kyle Walker. Ada Militao. 15 minutes till half time. Vinicius Junior. Rodri. Foden. Now it's Harland. Fran Garcia cuts out the pass. Alaba. Now who's going to be first to this? Valverde. Expertly cut out. Really nicely done. Moved on forwards. De Bruyne. And that is as far as they're going to go. Alaba. The referee's awarded a free kick. Walker wins the duel this time. Fadio. Well, that's an inviting ball. Well played. That has snuffed out the danger. Kovacic. And it reached half time. Well, there it is, half time. Not a bad watch by any means. And the efforts of both sides have been good, but neither have been able to penetrate. And so we reach the break. Nil nil. Here's the start of the second half. Manchester City clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Ruben Diaz. Played for Gomez. Foden. And the shot's on here. Oh, a shooting chance! Hosselu. Defenders on the back foot. Played for Garcia. Vinicius Junior. Vinicius Junior. He's going to run down the left wing. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. That has been cut short. That's a deception. His positioning was spot on. Vinicius Junior. Hosselu. It's run loose here. He's got plenty of space out wide here. Vinicius, can he put it away? Oh, the ball's run loose here. Foden. 
Haaland. No breakthrough and well into the second period. It is still anyone's game. Oh, he had to make that and he did make it. Stood up well to him there. Sends it forward. De Bruyne. Now it's Vinicius Junior. De Bruyne. Foden. Haaland. Nice physical challenge. Nacho. Well, the moans and groans from the stands now are very audible. And it's Alaba. For Valverde. Ede Militao. Played for Garcia. And it's played forward. Well, played right into his path. Oh, he's had a hit! And here's Modric. Madrid showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. That's been cut out. Well played. Vinicius Junior. Great defending. Strong and determined. Well, they deserve an awful lot of credit for their commitment to the cause, but it's a goal credit that would be most welcome now. Himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Because if that doesn't turn out to be the clincher, what a time to score. That was beautiful. Something close to genius. Oh, that was breathtaking. He'll never hit another as well in his whole career. Manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. City take the lead. Well, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. Real Madrid really are showing all the necessary urgency, but it's potency they need. Nacho gets over and intercepts. Manchester City probably could have killed things off, but they should be okay here. And that's another good win of the ball. That's just Nunes. De Bruyne. Manchester City can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Real Madrid making another change here. It looked as though that might lead to something quite promising, but it turned out that that was not the case. Hoisted upfield by the keeper. It's Bernardo Silva. Oh, it's come loose. 